Hey guys, it's Steve O for Dog Day Gaming and today I am playing on Extinction. I am playing on the Ozark Low Mod Server. It's an unofficial server, it's an Australian server and it's great. I've been playing on it for three weeks now and I, f I finally got a mic for Christmas so I'm able to record again. It's awesome. Now I'll just give you a quick quick look at my base. Now I'm the only person in my tribe. So everything you see here has been tamed, bred or built by me. And, and I've only been playing for about three weeks. So there's my um orange my orange um tech rexes. Yep, I'm getting them up to max uh the highest stats I can at the moment they're not max stats yet um, but these pink ones over here they're max stats for me which are 44 stem 22 weight 51 damage and 45 health yeah and I <laughs> I tamed two gigas on foot with only behemoth gates and I lost an owl each for each time so I lost two owls all up but I was able to tame them and I didn't die personally but my tames did but that's all right and I'm breeding a I'm breeding the first baby now yeah. so um as you can tell, we got um, Christmas uh, effect in, yeah, look, uh, tongue twisted there. We got a Christmas event happening where dinos are, are spawning all frequently in red and green and white Christmas colours. So everyone on the server's been out taming dinos. I've been doing the same thing. Yep, see my <laughs> my red and green beavers. I've even got a red and green tech rex. Now these are my these are my uh, male coloured tex rexes. Green and black, blue and black, red and black and green. You know, orange and white and black. And I like a dark blue and black, which I really like. And that's just my trike. And yeah, plant species Y, the best food now for um for gotchas. Yeah. Yep. And we'll have a quick look at the my inside of my base. This little building here is where it all started. I had my smithy and my um, fabricator in here, my bed in here, and um, then I built up like this. Made a bird pet, uh, bird area where I could land and tame, uh, breed birds. And then I thought it was a lot of wasted space, so. I built a walkway out here like this and then underneath and made this my hatching area so I can hatch my dinos here walk them out and up the ramp into the main holding area yeah. and then what I did then was I built this way and built a farm but it was too thin you know, you couldn't have like a walkway in between them. So I said, uh, I moved my, moved it over here. And this is where I got my farm now. With my dung beetles. And this is, this is my holding area. I had about 18 scorpions here so I could create 
kibble for um, Rexes, but I don't need that much kibble now. I mean, that many dinos because I've got one of these things. A friend made it for me. Yeah, you put one female of a of a dino in there, and every thirty minutes it lays an egg. So see, I've got like heaps of kibble. I mean, eggs for kibble. Uh, and if you want to know how I'm running tech stuff without a tech generator, um, I've got a mod on the game that um, you create an, a, um, an outlet and it can run tech gear from that outlet, but it costs element to make. To make. Uh, so then you got me artifacts. The first time I've got the artifacts legitly on an online server. So yeah, put them there. Some Christmas decorations around the place. You've probably seen them, see? Chrissy decks. There's a Chrissy tree, some snowman. And these guys, this, this green guy here, and this red guy here, they've both got that hat. That Christmas hat on, and they're called they're called Gutcha Claws. And you give them coal and um, mistletoe, and they give you presents and decorations. From you get the coal and mistletoe from Raptor Claws. He comes and drops presents. Yeah. That's the first T Rex I ever caught, and he's orange. So that's how I got my tribe name. I got my name from him, Mango. And yeah. So, yep. I can see out, they can't see in. Very festive. And then this is my, um, yeah, this is my crafting area. Everything like this. This is my attic where all the wires and water pipes are hidden. You just you don't even have to go in there anymore since we got this. Oh. See you can just teleport past the teleport past there. Bam bam. And then we're in the throne room. There we go, there's me there. Up here. And this is my... Yeah, this is my castle. Mango castle. It's my bird aviary. I built it this high so T-Rexes would walk underneath it and I could easily pick them off but I forgot about Giggers Giggers can bite up this high so I was a bit um yeah but it's still good a lot of people still love it and yeah um, oh yeah it's come down We come over. This is my carno breeding area. See one Christmas. I tamed it with an orange one. And we got an Aussie carno. Green and gold, buddy. Green and gold. Yeah. That's the way. Can't wait to get some more max level Rexes. Yeah. I love my coloured T-Rexes. I want to get more colours. I'm going to get a white one or a silver one and a pure black one because it's really hard on the server to get a black faced Tech Rex. You see, that's like dark green. 
you know? Because I'm going to have like half green, half black. Would look awesome. If that had a black ha head on it. This blue one looks awesome. But it'd look better with a blue or a black head on it, you know? So, yeah. And if I see a yellow one out there, I'll, t I'll tame a yellow one. Yeah. So, yeah. Um, I'm a real, like, yeah, Rex fan, eh? But, uh, so, yeah, so, basically, that's, that's it for my, um, first video. I just wanted to give you a, he a heads up. And next time I'm going out taming or something like that I'll, um, I'll bring you along for the ride now that I got my headset I got a really nice headset for, for Christmas so you guys have a Merry Christmas and I will catch you after Christmas bye